ह्यूमन बॉडी नर्वस सिस्टम एंड सेंस ऑर्गन्स पार्ट वन नर्वस सिस्टम द ब्रेन स्पाइनल कॉर्ड एंड द नर्व्स मेक अप द नर्वस सिस्टम इट इज अ सिस्टम यूज टू सेंड रिसीव एंड प्रोसेस मैसेजेस टू एंड फ्रॉम द वेरियस ऑर्गन्स एंड ऑर्गन सिस्टम्स इन साइड द बॉडी ब्रेन इट इज द मेन कंट्रोल सेंटर ऑफ द बॉडी प्रोटेक्टेड बाय द स्कल the brain monitors and regulates the body's actions and reactions it continuously receives information and rapidly analyzes this data and then responds there are three parts of brain first the cerebrum collects information from all sense organs and controls thinking and reasoning it is the center of thinking learning and memory second the cerebellum helps in coordinating body movements it is also responsible for the body balance posture and responsible for creativity third the brain stem lies below the cerebellum it connects the brain to the spinal cord is the part of the brain that controls breathing and heart rate nerves The nervous system consists of billions of nerve cells called neurons. Nerves act as a carriers of signals to and from the brain to all parts of the body. There are three types of nerves: sensory nerves, motor nerves, and mixed nerves. Sensory nerves carry messages from different parts of the body to the brain or the spinal cord. Motor nerves carry messages from the brain or the spinal cord to different parts of the body. Mixed nerves carry messages from different parts of the body to the brain or spinal cord as well as from the brain or spinal cord to different parts of the body. Spinal cord. The spinal cord is a long thin tube-like structure that extends from the brain down to the spinal column. It acts as a bridge between the brain and the rest of the body to transmit signals to and from the brain. It also plays a major role in our reflex actions. Reflex action. A reflex action is an immediate and rapid response to a stimulus. Reflex actions are not directly controlled by the brain. In humans, reflexes occur through a pathway called the reflex arc, which acts as follows the sensory neuron carries the message from the point of the stimulus to the spinal cord the spinal cord receives the message processes it and gives the response the motor neuron then carries the message to the point where the reflex occurs though it may sound like a very long and complicated process spinal cord sends reflex messages in less than a second Now let's recall the nervous system is like a control system to our body the nervous system is used to send receive and process messages to and from the various organs and organ systems inside the body the brain spinal cord and the nerves make up the nervous system the brain is the main control center of the body which is protected by the skull The cerebrum is the center of thinking, learning and memory. The cerebellum helps in coordinating body movements. The nervous system consists of billions of nerve cells called neurons. A spinal cord is a long thin tube-like structure that extends from the brain down the spinal column. A reflex action is an immediate and rapid response to a stimulus and are not directly controlled by the brain. Thank you.